Okay, hey everybody, it's Hannah. I totally just filmed the beginning of this video and then I realized that my camera casted this giant shadow on the side of my face, but I moved my camera back and I think I fixed it. Let me know what you think of this area and the lighting right now. I'm waiting for my studio lights to come in and that's why I've moved from my other spot to this spot because it's better lit. Because actually I only have two bulbs in my four bulb fan and they're both on this side so that might actually be why the lighting in this corner of my room specifically is the best. Today's video is a collab with Allison and Sarah who are both on the collab channel with me. I will link both of their channels down below along with the collab channels and then when they post their videos I will link those down below too. But Sarah texted us and said that she wanted to film a bucket list video and I thought that was really cool. I have a not so mild obsession with bucket lists ever since I watched the movie Bucket List with Morgan Freeman and Jack Nicholson like four years ago. And if Kira's watching this, I know she's totally laughing at me um, because she knows about my obsession with the bucket lists and I have been downplaying it. So currently on this list, I have it separated into categories of attainable, mildly attainable, and probably not going to happen to me. And you know what, I'm okay with that. There's a lot of things on my list that is probably not going to happen to me and that's okay. So I have a list on my phone and I'm just going to go down the list because before when I tried to film this with my camera shadow on like this half of my face, I decided that was too much stress. So I'm going to start from the top and go to the bottom and then you guys can see how attainable or unattainable the things are. The first thing on my list is to attend the Teen Choice Awards. I think it would just be a really fun time, it looks fun, even though it's rigged, I, um, if you didn't know that, it's rigged. My second goal that's on the list, these aren't in any order, I feel like I already said that, but they're not, is to become a famous YouTuber, so if you're watching this, thanks for helping me. And then next is to work as a Disney princess at Disneyland, and even though I say Disney princess, I would really work at anything at Disney World or Disneyland because I'm such a Disney nerd that I would do anything just to say that I worked there, to be honest. So, you can see where my standards are at that point. My next goal on the list is to go Christmas caroling. Uh, actually, we might have done like the southern version of Christmas caroling when I was younger, but I want to do it when I was older and go with friends. We drove around on a trailer and screamed Christmas songs through our neighborhood, like Christmas Eve. It was hilarious. Um, so that was fun, but I want to do the actual Christmas caroling where you're, where you're in a huddle and you go bother people at their houses. Perfect. Me. My next goal is to meet the cast of Supernatural, but as I've said before, I have a massive bucket list, so I couldn't list all the TV show characters and people I'd want to meet, so I just picked Supernatural for no reason other than I would like to meet the cast of Supernatural. The next two on my list kind of go together so I'm going to say them at the same time and that's to have my palm read and have my fortune told. I am obsessed with all things occult. It's so cool to me. I actually tried to convince my friend to take us to get our palms read when we were kind of driving downtown areas where we live and she was like no that's terrifying I'm not going in there so I didn't get to go I'm so disappointed she's ruining my hopes and dreams so wonder if she knows how bad of a friend she is uh, psychics are so cool to me I don't care if a lot of people think it's a scam I don't care if it's a scam I think it's just a cool experience to have to be able to tell my children. The next item on my list, I guess is the best way to put it, the next item on my list is to travel to every continent. Currently, I have only been to North America because that is where I live. So, six more to go. The next item on my bucket list is to own a typewriter and probably to eventually type on it, except I break everything so it would like explode on me. Um, but yeah, typewriters are cool, so. I want a typewriter apparently. So I can write Kira letters. Write you letters all typewritey. That's the goal. Next item on my list is to be fluent in another language. I took three years of Spanish and understood nothing by the third year. So. 
I want to take a language that I'm more interested in. Ideally, I would really like to learn ASL, but I'm open to other languages. If you speak a language, teach me things, please. The next one is to get a matching tattoo with my best friend, and my best friend would probably do that for me. For me and with me. Don't know what we would get, um, because currently we are both minors, and my parents said if I ever get a tattoo, they wouldn't pay for college, so it's gonna wait a little while. And then the last item on my bucket list is another two-parter, but I didn't put the second part because to all, it all makes sense. And that is to make a snow angel. I have never seen snow, that's real snow, in my entire life. I've seen ice, and ice is boring. So I want to see snow and then make a snow angel because you can't do the snow angel without snow. That's your lesson for today. That's what you came away from this learning. You can't make a snow angel without snow. That's everything for this video. I'm pretty happy with myself for this, not gonna lie. And if you have any video requests, let me know. Make sure to thumbs this video up and subscribe if you haven't. And then go subscribe to Sarah and Allison's and then the International Beauty channel. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye!